At around six to seven months, an infant will be ready to be moved on to different tastes and textures. Remember, every infant is different. Some infants will enjoy food from the beginning, whilst others will take longer to move on to different tastes and textures. When you and your infant are ready, this video shows you how to move on to different tastes and textures using a carrot and a parsnip. First, wash and dry the carrot and the parsnip. Carefully peel the carrot and the parsnip. Top and tail the carrot and the parsnip by carefully removing the top and bottom. Cut the carrot and the parsnip in half. Cut one half of the carrot and the parsnip into small pieces. You can refer to the video for sizing. Transfer the carrot to a microwave vented mug. Add one tablespoon of boiling water. Place the lid on the microwave and open the vent. Microwave on high for four minutes. Leave to stand for one minute. It will continue to cook in this time. Pierce the carrot with a fork to check it's soft and cooked throughout. If the carrot is still hard and not fully cooked, return back to the microwave on high for one minute. Leave to stand for one minute before retesting. If necessary, repeat this process until the carrot is fully cooked and soft throughout. This video uses an 800 watt microwave. Cooking times can vary between microwaves. It is important that you check the food is fully cooked before moving on. Once the carrot is fully cooked and soft, transfer to a plate and mash with a fork. Transfer the mashed carrot to a baby bowl. Add roughly two tablespoons of the infant's usual milk. You may need more or less milk depending on the size of carrot used. Once you have achieved a smooth mash, one which falls easily off the spoon, the carrot is ready to be served to the infant. The same method can be used to cook the chopped parsnip. Leftovers can be stored in the fridge or freezer for later. An ice cube sized tray can help with this process. This video was produced by NHS Tayside. If you require any more information on introducing solids, please refer to the links below.